hanging out again with my buddy Gavin here in India at Aaron One Engineering. Also, welcome back to MTD CNC India. And today we're going to talk about the importance of quality. I heard a rumor one time that said, you can't cut a part that you can't measure. What is quality and what does that mean to you, Gavin, here at Aaron One? Well, uh, uh, quality for us is, you know, is, the, is the soul of our business. Uh, without quality, we don't have any customers. And it's extremely important to really focus that to the, the team. And I'm sure when you walk around the, the facility, you can see that everything we try and do is all about quality, right from the cleanliness, right from the layout, right from you know, the pride in our branding. Uh, this is something that we emphasize to the team. Uh, and I've always pushed you know, that our reputation of everything. We cannot have customer complaints. We cannot have issues with parts because with that, then we won't have any future business. So Gavin, I know you work in a lot of different countries with a lot of different people, so I would imagine, based on where you are and where you're working, the ability to throw maybe more people to make sure that quality is there, the customers that you work with around the world really appreciate that quality and that focus that you have on quality, don't they? They do, and I think the, uh, the main issue we, we face, obviously being in a, in a lower cost region, is that people are expecting our quality to be automatically bad. So we have to start off with, with being guilty of poor quality, then we have to prove that our quality is good. So we're kind of working in reverse. The good aspects of being in low cost is it allows us to employ more people because obviously labor rates are less. And it, and it, it allows us to actually do what we're supposed to do by checking components, having the time to 100% to check, having the time to check each feature uh, correctly, and then offer a truly, you know, when we know that we're packing our parts, we know that the, the parts are correct. And this is the bi a big advantage to us that, you know, our quality I is right up there. We've, you know, we, we always uh, pitch ourselves against anyone in terms of what we do, you know. And then that really shows with the, the customers we've got, the continued support we have from our customers and the continued orders and allowing us to keep growing is because our quality is, is everything to us. And it's, it's something that I, I really take seriously, you know, I get upset. If my quality is bad, I get upset. The last thing I want is someone to come to me and say, oh, your quality is not good. You know, it's like my baby is uh, not performing, you know, so, yeah. I completely understand that. Guilty before proven innocent. You've mentioned to me that you kind of sometimes feel like you're punching up. You know, you're doing this, this small to medium-sized shop that's constantly growing. I would imagine getting parts back, obviously, other than just being emotional to, it's, it's your baby, right? Other than that, it's a loss of money. It's a loss of relationships, and you don't want that. Knowing your, your business character, you want your customers to be satisfied first time with good lead times every time. Of course, um, you know, lead times, quality is always, you know, a, to a topic in this industry, as we know, you know, everyone suffers with these two points. But certainly, quality is, is a given now. You cannot run a business without quality. It doesn't matter how cost effective you are and what lead times you've got. So we always say quality is given. And that's why we continue to you know, show by our investment plan that not only do we put investment in machines, but we always add something in quality. You know, that uh, from the very offset, what started to uh, allow us to grow is that we had five machines, but we, we spent an equal amount of money in our inspection department than we did on the five machines. So, you know, companies would walk in and say, wow, you know, you've got five machines, but you've got, you know, scanning, um, scanning machines as well as CMM, um, you know, optical measuring equipment we had at Rome from the offset. So that kind of like, they could see that we were serious about what we wanted to do. We wasn't just talking quality, which happens a lot, you know. Um, and you know when you walk into a shop from this, this industry, if it's going to give you a quality product or not. You just know. You get that feeling that you walk in, you see the, you know, the environment, you see the floor, and you think, you see what's around, and you go, yeah, I, I feel, you know, I'm feeling excited about it. And that's, when we get a customer here, we don't walk away without an order. Certainly domestically, but also globally, there are quality issues that happen from companies around the world right so people are watching right now hearing your passion and the fact that you had five machines and invested the same amount in that type of service are wanting to know how they can get in touch with you what's the best way is this through the website is through email how would you like them to contact you to learn more about Aaron one yeah I, th I think obviously we're very active on LinkedIn and a lot of our leads actually comes from that uh, uh, people seeing us on there and and reaching out to us um, we're still we are 
we're still very much unknown, really, about what we can do. You know, we're um, we're still a fresh company, a new company. But I think if you you know people want to understand what we can do in terms of you know our manufacturing capabilities and our quality, they should either go through the website or they should drop us an email at info at aaron1engineering.com. Absolutely perfect. So all of you who are paying attention right now, learning from this really great example of what it takes to invest in quality. Take a look at Gavin, Gavin Price, Aaron Engineering. Quality is incredibly significant as you can see. Gavin, thank you so much for sharing that thank story you. with MTD and the global audience that's watching you, my friend. Thank you.